Three people were killed in a crash tonight in Bell County. It happened on U.S. Highway 119 just south of Varilla Curve. WYMT's Caleb No has more from the scene. Well, there was actually no 911 call even needed as just seconds after the crash, a state trooper rode up onto the scene, but at the time had no idea how bad it actually was. Three people were killed in the initial collision. We are told a silver SUV traveling south toward Pineville crossed the center line and slammed head on into a white car. It's a very uh, extensive collision. It's a uh, uh, it's a pretty bad one. A third car, a maroon Cadillac, then swerved to miss the other two, hitting a guardrail. Fortunately, none of the three people in that car were hurt. I just went picking a little girl up from the school. Robert Rice was driving the maroon car. Yeah, I just checked them out, made sure they was okay, and then I got out and checked the other people in the vehicles, you know. And they wouldn't no response. And he says he is lucky and thankful to be alive. I mean, I can see it happening, you know, and I like to just try to stop. And... The names of those killed in the crash have not been released. It's very heartbreaking to have to, you know, go to the family and notify someone's family that their loved one has been killed in a car wreck. At the exact point of the collision, on the side of the road, stands a large wooden cross. Truly just a sad night here in Bell County as family members and friends cope with the loss of their loved ones. Reporting on U.S. Highway 119, Caleb No, WYMT Mountain News. All right, and we just received word that Highway 119 is open again. Obviously, we'll continue to keep you updated on this situation as more details are released regarding that crash.